Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Plymouth Argo career mode. In the last episode, it was a bit of an up and down, kept changing formation, trying to find the one that to get our form back. As you can see on the calendar here, as you can see, 3-1 uh, loss against Derby. It was just annoying, wasn't it? I mean, it was just one of them. But then we moved on against Fleetwood and picked up the 3-4 win, and then the, also the 3-0 win against Accrington. A little bit of revenge against them, against bottom of the table. But hey, the 3-5-2 worked. But on to today's episode and starting off with the Papa John's Trophy in the semi-finals at Moulton Road. I think it's technical glitch, I think it's at home park, so let's jump into the pre-match uh, pre conference and go into the semi-finals. Come on. Okay, welcome everyone. We'll be starting with questions now. Oh yes. Big game, it is a big game, it's a semi-finals video. Yeah, I respect what they've done, they, uh, they got four. We're looking to win this, we'll win as much as possible as we can with this career mode as so, uh rebuild kind of uh, career. Especially second in the table, we're not going to win the titles, so it'd be nice to finish the season with a bit of silverware. We'll be a physical against North Country. I'm confident against anyone. We are, we just bottles sometimes, we just, we don't turn up on the day. Very in and out. Good questions today. Finally, some good questions. Very true, but in and out. Always working hard at it. We are indeed. Switching things around. Tried the narrow formation. Now we're on the 3 5 2. Hopefully, That's we can continue all. Thank on the you cut. guys. Let's get into the lineups. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the lineup we're going with today. 3 5 2. I feel like the left mids and right mids, especially Edwards, they were very good in the free you know, uh, win against Everton in this formation. So I want to neutralise them a little bit more. As I said, I kind of want to do like the local vibe with Trent and uh, Robertson kind of thing with the full backs going up and helping out the attack on the overlaps. It looks like they're playing a five back, so it's going to be interesting against a three back and a five back. But as we know, it is a cup game, so let's get into the highlights and see if we can pick up the win against Newport County at home park. Yeah, man. So here we have it then, the semi-finals in the Papa John's Trophy. Like I said, it would be very nice to pick up a bit of silver this this season, at least one. Would be brilliant. Hopefully the boys can go all the way here. One last game and win the final. There we are. Uh, Ipswich or Bolton in the final. Ipswich would be a very, very big game considering the top of the league. We do not want to get uh, them to get the double. So if we can take one of them. I'll be a happy man. But let's get into it. Let's see how we get on. Here we go. Kick off, Hardy. Here we go. Oh no, this is not the start we want. Third minute in, penny kick for Newport County. This is not the start we want. How does this happen then? Who took the foul? Uh, and he's banged it into the top left corner. That is not the start we want. EA's mugged us off there. And the ginger hair striker. Bangs it into the top left corner. Right in front of our fans. What a rat. Can't believe it, but come on. Corner kick. We need Banzer back here, man. Because that's a shocking start. Put me a right pickle. Hopefully he favours us. We've got the home advantage. Let's swing this in. Good ball. Hardy's there. Oh, we're still alive. we go outside. Little finesse. Oh, unlucky. Oh. Corner kick, corner kick, cross on the tree, sorry, corner kick, what a shocker. That post is on, you can see it. Is he going to run in? He's there. Oh, it's gone over. Cross on the tree for Blue and Fog on the 45th minute. Come on. We need to go here. Oh, he's in the box. This is it, work it up. Edwards. Charge on the defence. Finds Ryan Hardy. Good ball. Oh, what a save from Townsend. What a save. I'll go attack in the 50th minute. We're getting close. Out wide. To Mumba. Scored an absolute bang against Exeter the other day. Can he do the same again today? Oh, he's making a run. Just try to go for it. 68th minute, it's getting tight in now. Cross on the tree for Newport County. There we go. 
Wheel mark. Good block. Come on. Counter attack. Need to make this uh, counter. There's a ball through the middle. What a ball that is. Wick has got to score this. Whitaker, yes! There's one all in the 77th minute in the Papa John's Trophy. What a ball and what a goal from Whitaker. We're back in it. It's what we want to see. The fans are going wild. I'm so glad I didn't bottle that man. So glad. Got a bit squeaky bunt on there, but we made it count. Here we go again here. 81st minute. Ryan Hardy against four defenders. All five, I can't count. Ah, oh, shit, what a shocker. And that is full time, one all. Very interesting. I don't know if this goes on to extra time or it's a replay. I'm not too sure. I think it goes to extra time. Let's find out. Oh, maybe not then. We have got a penalty shootout. I thought it would have gone to extra time, but fair enough. Squeaky bum time now. Let's see if we can win this penalty shootout. They have got better pen takers, it seems like. In the top three. Let's get into it. Here we go then. Whitaker steps up. Can he make it 1-0 for Argo? Yes, he can. Well done. Come on, Coop. Need you to step up here, my man. Yes! I've done the right way. Come on! I'm going bottom right. Oddy. Oh, he saved it. Townsend. He scored one already. Can he do it again? He can. Puts it in the same spot. As that. Good pen. Well done. Here we go. The captain for Newport County. Can he put it away? Yes, he can. It's like this. Mayor. Been a bit controversial recently. Oh, and he stays there. Went down the middle. Wilmot. Oh, no. This is not looking good. I've got to score this. Edwards, not him. No, nah, Edwards don't bottle this. Watch this. Two. Yes, come on. Come on, Coop. Hey, that's the right way here. No, and they've done it. Newport have gone through to the final. Argo are out of the cup. It's not the way we want it. We brought it back. Shit celebration from Lewis. He sent Cooper the wrong way. And Newport go through to the final against Ipswich or Bolton in the Papa John's Trophy. It's just one of them. I mean, it's a penalty shooter. It's 50 50, really. I think we've beaten the AI twice on penalty shooters, and they've got us this time when it mattered. <sighs> Annoying. But that's the way it is. We continue on. One or go, and Newport go through on pennies, and I fall through. So, ladies and gentlemen, before we get into the next game, I have got some tournament prize money, which is around about 60 grand. I'm going to take it. Whatever, it's one of them, innit? We don't care about the money, we want the trophy. But we have got a youth scout report available here, so let's have a look at this. See if we found any more potential ballers for the team. Joshua Herbert, nah, you're a bit corrupt, mate. Elliot Moore, drip, mate. Les, shocker. Max Garrett, 70 to 94, 15 years old. We'll get him in, see what he's all about. And it looks like the rest isn't that good. So let's go check out that uh, player we signed in there, and we'll get into the game. Here we go then. So Max Garrett is 15 years old. 51 overall, a right wing back. Let's see where any else he can play to maybe boost some stats up a little bit. Mm, he doesn't look like a defender to me. It looks like he's got better on the dribbling, the passing, and the pace. So could this be a potential of a winger for us? That's the question. Let's have a look at the positions here. Yeah, let's have a look at that, should we? Could be quite a good cam. Not a bad little cam. I think I'm going to try and go him for a cam. I think he's got not bad passes. Pace is a meh. Shooting needs to go up a little bit more, but Drummond's nearly there on the agility as well. So let's put him in attacking midfielder. Four weeks. See how he gets on. See if he grows up a little bit. He's still 15, so he should be in the academy for like a good year or two left. See how we get on. And let's get into the next game. So here we go then, ladies and gentlemen. The next game is against Cheltenham Town. At away, I believe. We are sitting in third place, as you can see, with Sheffield Wednesday and Ipswich above us. MK Don's knocking on our tail. Cheltenham 11th place, they're a mid-table team. Should hopefully get the win, especially with this 3 5 2 that we've got set up today. So let's get into the pre match conference and let's get into this game. Bye, guys. Thank you all for coming. We'll start taking questions now. Could have been a brilliant way to open the episode, but it just wasn't meant to be. EA mowed us off. 
and we lost on the penalty shootout. It is what it is on the semis, but we continue on with the league now. Promotion is the real goal here. Can your boys still go up? Of course we can. Let's finish strong. Oh, well, I didn't realise I was a negative. I went that in a, in a nice way. Oh, whatever then, game. <laughs> Last around, you're playing off a team. Ritz turning 5 0 up. Oh, okay. So if we could do it again, that would be nice. We'll try our best. Town Town versus Plymouth looks like a pretty even contest on paper. I'm sure you've got a plan to win the game. How do you plan to approach it? Oh, you trying to approach it. We're going to make chances. 100%. We sometimes slap on chances. This is the whole reason why, I've, you know, with the whole formation changes. But I'm hoping the 3 5 2. Okay, guys, can thanks open so much for today. See you next time. For the team. But let's get into the game in the line. Two subs today. Miller is on for Mumba in the left mid spot. I need to give him some more game time. And also the new signing Phillips comes in for the white van like that he is still not done their rendering on. So yeah, that's the only stuff I've got to do. I've got to give them more game time because I want them to grow a bit higher, especially in Miller. So let's get into this game against Jonathan away at Court Lane against their five back formation, it seems. Let's get it going. There he is. For me, the player of the season, 27 goals. Unbelievable stat. Probably won't get it though, we'll probably give it to Nitrich player. Especially with the form they're in, it's unbelievable. They should do the double. I say we're their only threat. You see what Bolton can do in that uh, final in the Providence Trophy. But anyway, we don't care about them now. We're on about other league. It's getting close to the league. You know, it's. We'll see what happens at the end. Hopefully, we can go up. Let's continue on with the game at hand. Come on, boys. There you go. Come on, then. Oh, better run through first. Oh, there we go, easy. I forgot to mention um, my LB button seems to be a bit stuck. So if I can't play a switch, that's why I need to get a new controller. It wasn't out of rage. <laughs> I don't know, I just jumped on one day and, you know, I just decided not to wear it. Maybe I dropped it. I don't know. We continue on. Oh, well. Yeah, but I am a bit of disadvantage, so I do apologize. I need to get that fixed. Very annoying. Let's play this. They're going to the box to Hardy on the volley. Oh my god, how's that gone in? I think it took a deflection, but we don't care. Ryan Hardy steps up again. The dynamic duel of Edwards and Hardy links up once again this season. Unbelievable. I don't know what happened there, man. Well, let's have a little look at it again. Is it like a deflection, maybe? Yeah, oh my, say that. <laughs> Where was Ed? He's had a shocker, number two. He's going to get a bit of a nosebleed after that. Look at that. I like it. Bong right in his head. And it's bonged into the goal. The keeper could get down enough. But we take those. We take those. We continue on. 1-0 to Argo. Come on. What a ball that is. Oh, unlucky. Yeah, I thought he was a solid with that. A little bit of deflection pass. What a ball that was, though. Really good, this 3 5 them. I'm getting a lot more space. You've noticed that Mayer hasn't really been starting uh, in the cup in this game. Yet. I just, I'm not very happy with him. and he's a step up, man. So, you know, hopefully if his time reflect on the bench, he could uh, see why. Overlaps on there. Edwards, can he get a little dink? Uh, just try a little dink there, but it just went a bit too far. Looking really dangerous, though, man. Really dangerous. And then it goes inside. And there still. Finds Ryan Hardy. Back to Miller, perhaps. Miller on the first time shot. Unlucky. That's a really good ball. Oh my god, what a finish that is. What a finish that is from Cheltenham Town Striker. Oh my god. I didn't even bring him out, Cooper. I think he just naturally came out a little bit. I just realised who it is. I've just realised who it is. We've been done by one of our former players. The absolute rats and broom. What a finish from him, though. Maybe that's what we need in Argo a little bit more. And what a finish from the 32. Broom, broom. Dinks it over Cooper. And it's one all straight away. Not good. 
scored a good goal. I can't take it away from him. But we need, need to come on. We need to bounce back here. This is a part of the season we can't drop points really. I think over the box. Back to Ryan Hardy. I've gone for it. Jermaine shot. Ooh, I went for it. That would have been a banger if Ryan Hardy scored that bad boy. Azaz with a long shot inside your table would bit over the ball. Oh blah, blah, blah. can't speak. What a shot though that was. Good save from the keeper. Butcher on the corner. Come on. Let's get in there. Swing it in. It's going in. Azaz got a lot of space. Oh, good chance. Unlucky. Ooh, gotta watch him. Oh, Miller, that's poor. I know he's not a defender, but he should do better there. Oh, my goodness gracious me. Oh, my goodness gracious me. I thought I was in, to be honest. I thought he was thinking over. But luckily, it's just gone over. Keep out of control anyway, it seemed. And here we go. Come on. Oh, bad ball. Really bad ball. Not the best ball there. Hit him down, hit him. Ah, oh, lucky. Jackson, go watch this. Well done, Wilson. Oh, well done. Here we go. Come on. Lots of room to run to here. Good overlap there. What a ball. Can he get into the mixer? Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. Not too bad. Not too bad. I feel like we can definitely get a goal and bring this back, man. I'm confident. What a challenge for Butch. One more. Oh, it's just off. I wanted it to Azaz and Azaz didn't really run up. It's a bit annoying. Uh, a bit annoying, man. But it looks like we're going to go 2-1 down at half time here. Need a big half. And there it is. Half time. 2-1 down. Broom with a masterclass finish. And then an uh, absolute shitty tapping. We cannot drop points and we cannot drop down to third place from a former Argo player that would just will not be good but yeah Cheltenham 2 Argo 1 I'll let you know for me the several changes come on radio so two substitutions I've done is Mumba on for Miller and Phillips on for the off for the white man Dyke, which you can see in the top left corner both a bit tired and Miller wasn't really impacting I feel like a way where I feel like Mumba does and he does get back and up with defence so Hopefully it's worked out well for me. There it is! Oh, I wasn't speaking, I was trying to concentrate, but good effort there from Whitaker. But you now. Come on, get a better delivery now. More power. A lot better power. Hardy's there for the header! Oh, and it's just getting the side net and it seems. Good chance from Hardy. He's actually quite good in the air to be fair. Just got a nice header, cup of back. It just goes part of the post. Come on. Oh, done. Here we go now. Hardy. So I was thinking of Hardy again, but... As as we were done. The work has got a lot of room to find to hit. Oh, I just tried to bounce past him there. Oh, if I would have got that there. There's Van Dyke. Here we go, come on. A lot of room here. It's a three on three. Good ball to Hardy. Oh, just need to get that open space, don't we? Just got to go attacking, I feel like. Just got a little bit attacking. Get our players a bit more higher. Challenge from the new signing, Phillips. Well done. Good ball as well. Oh, it's a shocking ball there from oh, where to go. He needs to do better there. Could have got a good chance there. I've got through somehow. Room. It's a danger man for them. Well done. Well done. Come on. Hey, wide. Oh, Hardy, that's sloppy. That is sloppy. Room again. Good save, Coop. 
I'm just going to make some substitutions and we'll get back into it. I'll let you know what I've done. Corner kick here. Oh, oh I can't get into what I've done. Yeah, no mamba. Uh. Yeah, basically what I was going to say is Mayer comes on for Azaz and Ennis comes on for Whitaker. Oh, mamba. Oh, I was going to cut in, he didn't do it though. Oh, I nearly got that. Well done. Phillips turning up today. Little dinkle at the top. Yes, Mayer, a lot better from him. Good ball to Ennis! Ennis! Oh, you've got to get more power on it. That was all Mayer there. But Ennis needs to pick that away better, man. Not a little tap in, I want you to bang it. Let's get into the mox here. Into the box, come on. Hardy's there again, Hardy! Oh, it's gone to the other post! Oh. We deserve a goal here, man. It's gone to the other side now. Come on. Just gonna watch that run. Wilson's been beaten here. And they've made it 3 1. Oh, what has happened there in the defence? Wilson's been caught for dead. And Jackson, the 27, has made it 3 1 to Plymouth Argo. This could be the back to back losses here. One in the cup and now one in the league. It's just got tight now, the league. 15, I don't know. Maybe Butch, to be fair, not Wilson, sorry. No, no, it wasn't. No, I'm completely wrong. It was 15 in the new Simon Phillips. He's had a brilliant game. Tried to drag Kuba to the right side because I knew where he was going to go. It was a great finish off the post and it's gone in. Just hasn't been our day today, man. I feel like, I feel like the 3 5 2 is the way going forward, though. We've had some great chances to start a half. Now it's just gone a bit poopy. Come on, we can. If we can get one here. Ball to the top of high and hardy. It's just not the best ball for Ennis, though, is it? I feel like we've only got one decent stroke on the team now. Well done, still in, though. Uh, he's just... He's... Well, oh, come on. Hardy. Oh, lucky lad. He's got nowhere to run. I've got nowhere to shoot. I've got good nowhere to turn. Ah. Not good. Get it up there. Head it down. Looking for Ennis on the other lap. He can get it. Come on. He needs to score this. Ennis. Yes. Come on. Grab the ball. Screw it. No time to celebrate. Ball out attack now. Play for the draw. Come on, boys. And hit him. Oh, done. Well done, Mayer. Here we go now. Number four wants it. Someone overlap me. Hardy's there, back post. Oh, Hardy, no, you've got to play it back. Hardy's got to play that back. I'm sorry. Oh, it's still alive. In the box. Raf, Raf, that's a joke. Why is he brought it there? I didn't even foul him. Oh, Hardy just needed to pull back that pass. Still alive, though. Someone overlap me. Number. There it is. Come on. Overlap's on. That post. Butch is there. Still in. Oh, and they've blown it. Oh, so annoying. We could have nicked the three all draw there at the end, but I just couldn't get that last pass with Hardy on that cutback. And it is a loss for Plymouth Argo away. Let's just hope the, uh, the team behind us drop points as well, because it's getting really tight to the end of the season now. We do not want to be at the playoffs. We want to automatically go up. But this doesn't help us with the loss here today. Should have got the draw there at the end. But we just couldn't get it. Annoying. Cheltenham 3, Argo 2. So here we go then, ladies and gentlemen. The next game is at Home Park against at Oxford United on 53 points. Let's have a quick look at the standings here. As you can see, the league's already won by us, which we knew this a couple of episodes back. Sheffield right in front of us on the goal difference. And as you can see there from that loss, MK Dons has snuck up still at one point. I think did they win their last game? Let's have a look. Oh no, they didn't. They did lose their point. Oh, so we did get a bit let off there. I think how did Portsmouth get on? Let's have a look at Portsmouth, shall we? Let's have a look at that. They won 2 1, so they're up there now in the uh in the battle. It's getting tight, you can see you can see it here. So we just we've just got to keep winning our games. Hold on. 
Anyway, let's get into this game against Oxford. They did win their one uh, last game, 1 0 against Forest Green away. Hopefully, we can make a stop to that and finally get our first win of the episode. Come on. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the line for today. The only change I've done is Ennis on for Whitaker. Ennis seemed a little bit better that last game. He just he definitely should have scored, but let's just keep playing him. I'm, I'm going to give him more chances. I feel like he can come back, man. He did score at the end. He should have also scored before and the easy chance, but it is what it is. Home park against us for United. Let's see how we get on against them. Let's go. Here we go then. Home park once again. A game, every game now, to be honest with you, is a must win. It's just, uh, again, it all comes down to consistency. Like, just sometimes we bottle against smaller teams. I kind of like about that this FIFA, though. I feel like if a team's that good, in previous FIFAs, you can just win every single game. It's just a bit unrealistic. So, it's nice to see some lower tier teams, uh, some good teams bottling and winning sometimes. Just makes it more realistic. Regardless of that, let's get into this game and hopefully we can pick up our first double of the episode. Come on. Here we go then. Must win game. Good start here. On the counter attack. Ref, that's a foul. Hmm. I don't know about that one, Ref. I feel like it was a foul. It's all good. All good. All good. Edwards is there. Oh, I lost it though. Just try to get it out. Come on. It's a good ball. Get out! That was close. That was close. Let's take a ball drawn a full back to uh foul back, not the offside. Good one twos here. Ed wants it back. Oh, unlucky Edwards. Really unlucky. Really play from him. Hardy. Hardy, but just sorry, I don't like Hardy there running back. <laughs> and a scar. Better tackles there, lads. Come on. Oh, we've been a gap there. So we to hold him up, hold him up. Well done. Just need to get this ball now, lads. Well done. Well played from Wilson. Gonna be missed. It's one of them, innit? Alright, out, lads. It's alright, out. Good save from Coop. What a save that is. Let's have a little replay on that one there from the defender. Good shot on him. A little uh, bigly boo, but keep it pulls off that little pot shot save. Could have been dangerous. Didn't want to go 1 0 down again, man. Alright, out. That's it. Better. Lovely play from Argo, this. Lovely. Ennis wants it. Does well. Holly on the rebound touch. There we go. Somehow we got through. Ennis. Oh my god. Again. Missing easy chances. We should have took advantage of that. We got lucky to get through. And he skimmed the post. He needs to be burying them though. Could we be looking at another striker in the new season perhaps to bring in with Hardy? Because Cosgrove prefers to now Ennis. They're just not turning up. You got that, you got that. You don't want it. You don't want it. Oh. Nice play. Come on. What ball that is. Did not expect that to happen. That's a shot. Surely not. <laughs> that was a shot. That's a shocker. Pass the side. Uh, back pass there. Come on, Ennis. I know it's a back pass, so I'll let him off with that one, but still. Shocking. Come on. Unlucky. Ooh, one on one over Wills. Well done. Well played. I think Oxford's been the better team so far, but we've had the better chance. But just didn't put it away, man. Oh, he's actually sent me. Well played. Oh my god, not get off the post. Jesus Christ. Let's go wide. Head it down. Nice. Here we go. Oh, I've got a lovely play this. Mama's on the overlap. 
Can we neutralise this? Back post. Oh, hello. Oh, I was aiming for back post there, but it nearly fell to Ryan Hardy. Did lock onto him. Unlucky. Nearly really better our chances there, to be fair. That's a good ball, but that should be scores. Well done. What a challenge. From Scar there. The Maestro at the back. Oh, they got to get it off. There's a foul though, to be fair. It was a bit from behind. Stop the counter attack. It's very been an upbeat game here. Got a quick one here. I'm shooting it. Uh, yeah, it's bits over the bar. Looks like the defender did pick up a yellow card there. Seeing the opening, it's just gone really far up a bit. Of the wide of fucking goal, mate. It's just, that was a shock in that. There's no sugar coat in that, is it? Let's be honest. Oh. Really nice play from Oxford, to be fair. Lovely football. Oh, we should have got that. That's a win. Squash overlap. And again, squash the second one. Oh, no, son. Not high pressure here, but really nice big composure there from Argo. Here we go. Massive gap there. That's Hardy. Brian Hardy. He don't miss. Ah. Oh. That would have been naughty. I had to do it. He was coming across me. He's still alive there. Eh? Very close to poor football. Oh, it's just too fast gone to the wrong player. I wanted to uh, Edwards on the wing. But it is 0 0 at half time. I don't know why. Oxford's had some right chances. We've had the better chances, but I think Oxford's been the better team. I need to get that man in front of goal, like a nice clear cut chance. Hopefully, we can pick up the win here today, though, man. But now we know at half time. I'll let you know if I've done anything. But let's get into the second one. Really, ladies and gentlemen, the only sub I've done is Ennis off from Miller up top. Before I tried Miller up top, he did uh, do a bit of silky skill and a couple of skill to beat some defenders. And I think we need that nimble, quick player, especially on the ball and the attack, to help out Ed Hardy. So hopefully, he can bring a bit of shine to this game. Let's switch there. And again, overlaps on. Lovely overlap. Getting to box the middles there. Uh, I'm lucky, lad. Getting quick, that's it. Put him under pressure and we get it back. Look, well done. Played. Oh, not the best pass from Butch, though. Needs to be better there, man. Oh, and the through here. Wilson's got a big job, this. Uh, he can't get to him. Oh, and they've scored again. Oxford have made it 1-0. Oh no, this is not good. This is not good. It's a great finish and Cooper just couldn't get to it. Jones has been a dangerous player this Jones all game to be honest. He's always been involved in everything. <sighs> what has happened there? I've got to blame Butch there, man. That pass was shocking. Can't blame Wilson there. He's got so many marks. It's a brilliant finish. We need to answer back, man. Come on. We cannot lose again. Good turn. Really nice turn. Hardy wants it. Ryan Hardy's there. Go on, Hardy. Make it count, lads. Second if he can. Oh, unlucky. Good shot. Unlucky. Good save to be honest. Oh, what a ball. Edwards! Yeah! The captain steps up. Come on, grab the ball. The captain steps up. Well done. Come on. Lovely little one two there. I was trying to concentrate, so I wasn't speaking. I apologise. What a ball from Azaz. What a finish this was from Edwards. Take no tennis. Great finish. Come on, let's win this game now. No draws. We want to win. Oh, unlucky. Try to get that one two there. Just couldn't get it off. Come on. Sorry, right, I got Mumba. Should be able to bring back. It's a really nice pass inside. And again, it's Jones both dangerous man. Hot shot, well done. Put him off. What's the quick substitution here? Nah, I'm not going to do that. Edwards has been doing bits, man. 
He needs to stay on the pitch. Not going to do that sub. Not feeling it. Come on. That's it, it's gone. Come on. So he's been it in. So we can go, come on, man. That's alright, little one to Van Dyke. Oh, he wants it. Oh, oh that's alright, though. We take that. Went to the wrong player. We take those. Very annoying. Well play, what a time I should butch. Oh, what are you doing, man? That's shocking. Still alive though. Need an option. Again, still need options. Oh, try to get lucky. Nah. Play it down for them though. Unless there could be a sub here for them. It's down bad. It looks like his knee. I don't care with this though. How about you, rat? Come on. Drop ball, bit in the win. Just need to neutralise this, man. All out attacking, man. I don't care. We need to get a goal. We need a win in these games. Big Ed. Oh, he's got that. Oh, he just hasn't done anything with it. It's a terrible ball. I don't remember. Pass inside. It's a ball there. Come on, Azaz. Azaz! Yes! We've got it! It's 2-1 to Plymouth goal. Finally. Well done. Come on. What a ball and what a finish from Azaz. The ultra attack worked. Committed more players forward. And we've got the goal. We've been rewarded for it. Mother man in goal has been out of that. Absolute shocker. Good ball here from Butch. Brilliant ball to be fair. Good run from Azaz. And it's an easy finish for him. What's the quick substitution? Butch, up. Why the hell? Oh, it's because it's ultra attack, I think. <laughs> I was going to say, what the hell? That threw me off. Let's go back to balance now. Let's see off this game. As you know what, I'm going to go defence. Defender, actually, because we need a win here. A bit of pressure here. It's alright, I'm just going to wing up the pitch. Can you get that? Go on, mate. Get up there, lad. Well done. There it is again. Hardy's through. Can he make it? Can he end the game here? On his weak foot. Yes, of course he can. There it is. Game, set and match. They committed players forward. And we've punished him for it. There I am doing limbs with it. Come on. Great limbs from the Ogle players here. We needed this win. Get the confidence back in the team after the two losses. We're up there and we're there to stay. We're going up. I've said it. Great finish into the top right corner from Hardy. Like I said, these committed players forward. Well, they had to really, didn't they? And then we just uh, we punished them for it. Free winner Plymouth Fargo. We've got the winner today. Happy days. Well done. Good one too. And Hardy's through again here. Can Hardy make it 4 1? Hardy! Good save. We could have made it 4 1 there. That would have been a nice little cushion. Well, not really a cushion. I mean, Jesus Christ, we know we've won the game. This is all just. To be fair, though, to win this game and get more goals, to get the goal difference, that would be good. Let's get in the box here. Last kick of the game. Can Hardy get another one here? No, that's got to be it. Happy days, though. Finally picked up a win for this episode. Happy days. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. 3 1 to the mighty Argo. We left it to the late minutes. It doesn't matter. A win is what matters. Happy days. I mean, to be fair, Edwards had a brilliant game. I've got to give him out of the match. I think he stepped up today. Led this team to the win. But let's get on to the conference and see what they've got to say. Come on, well done, boys. Some questions regarding the match. Oh, yes. Are you always confident about winning this game? Every single one of the lads was committed to their job, yeah, 100%. I wouldn't say we defended well because it was a bit sloppy, but it's better bringing it back, that's what mad. Really turn things around, how? Yes, on a resilience, you know it. Look at the heart of a lion. 
in the shield here today. That was a pretty impressive free goal for me today, Argo. Would you say you controlled the game pretty much from the start to finish? Nah, not at all. I wouldn't say. Not at all. Maybe the scores don't flattered us, yeah, I'd say that. Yeah, they were right to be fair. We left us the last minute to actually turn up the. And also, we punched them on their attack. Well, thank you for the uh, questions. Let's move on. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to leave the episode here. As you can see, though, the next game at Ivy Lane is against first in the league. A big test for this for us. A massive test and a must win, to be honest. You can see there was Sheffield in second place. We need to get back into that second place position, man, if we want to automatically go up and dodge the playoffs. It's a must. Who have they got next? Let's have a little look who Sheffield's got next. Let's have a little gander, see if we can find it. So they have got Portsmouth away. Hopefully Portsmouth, which are in fourth place, can pick up their result against them. If they can get the result against them, and we can get the result against Ipswich, we can jump into that second row. Second place, sorry, and stay there. But let's find that out in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.